Special teams can make or break a game, and for multiple years, Joe Jones was a key piece to the Denver Broncos special teams units. Despite that, he has never really cracked a role on defense. Jones is entering his fourth year in the NFL and just turned 26 years old in February. He entered the NFL as an undrafted free agent out of Northwestern University. When he originally committed to Northwestern, it was as a running back and he was converted to linebacker. He recorded 70 tackles in his career as he was learning a new position. Originally signed as an undrafted free agent by the Dallas Cowboys, Jones moved around quite a bit in 2017. He spent time with the Chargers and Seahawks as well before the Broncos picked him up. He appeared in seven games his rookie year, mostly on special teams, and the team kept him around for 2018, where he played in all 16 games, but again, mostly on special teams. There were issues with his 2019 season dealing with injuries, but also seeing him have a role on special teams be essentially replaced by Josie Jewell, who has more experience on defense than Jones does. Jones just hasn't been able to develop on the defensive side of the ball, and that can really kill his chances of making the Broncos roster for the 2020 season. When they didn't have other options for his special teams role, it made sense to keep him, but they do now. Versatility is a must in the NFL, and Jones just hasn't shown that he has it. While potential has flashed, development is needed to make those flashes more consistent. That hasn't been there with Jones, but he's still young and could still potentially show it. Time is running out, however, and if he wants to stay in Denver, he has to show that development now. If he doesn't, it seems pretty safe to say that he won't find himself on the roster. For Mile High Huddle and Sports Illustrated, I'm Eric Trickle.